Congratulations, Captain. You got the City Hall bomber. We got it. Tomato, tomato. My point is, you've been burning the candle at both ends lately. You should take a vacation. I'm not exactly the tourist type. But once we've rounded up the rest of Lee's people, maybe I will. No planes, no suitcases, just uninterrupted sleep. Oh, you are a party animal. But hey, whatever floats your cruise ship. Or doesn't. You've earned it. Peter! Y you okay? <sighs> I'm getting by. I don't know how I feel about you running this place all by yourself. And these people need help. If I lose a few hours of sleep, so be it. So have you heard from Mr. Lee since? <sighs> no. But the Martin I know couldn't have done that. Whatever's become of him, that's not the one I want to remember. So... How are things with MJ? Oh, it's, uh... Well, you know, she's, uh... It's, uh... It's, it's complicated. Honesty. That's what got me and Ben through the rough patches. You guys had rough patches? Oh, sure. Especially when we were your age. So... Are you honest with her? Does she know the real you? Hey! Turn it up! I want to hear this! A spokesperson for the police has confirmed that this was the truck carrying the device used in the Grand Central Terminal attack. Oh, it never ends. Peter? Captain Watanabe, leave a message. Yuri, where are you? Call me when you get this. I just hope the Devil's Breath is still there, and still secure. If the demons got to that truck, this just went from bad to catastrophic. <laughs> 